Jake Gyllenhaal plays an imaginary bugle. Jarhead. When Jake Gyllenhaal joins the Marines, he is hazed by Jamie Foxx, who then trains him as a sniper. From now on, you will speak only when spoken to. And the first and last words out of your filthy sewers will be, sir. Do you maggots understand that? Sir, sir yes, sir. Bullshit, I can't hear you. Sound off like you got a pair. Before being deployed to Iraq, where monotony is their first enemy, along with loved ones. What would you do if you were stuck in one place, and every day was exactly the same, and nothing that you did mattered? Now that sums it up for me. Then he starts a fire in the camp, and ends up being demoted, then has a mental breakdown, then brands a fellow Marine. Who are you calling a psycho? I didn't say anything to you. Before being teased with a sniper kill that is ultimately stolen by an airstrike, then returning to their boring humdrum lives. I know this is hard to hear. So, uh, I thought this was going to be kind of funny, but it's actually kind of sad. So, I'll catch you later, Harrison. Worth watching for Lucas Black. Either join the Marines or go to jail. And you know what the shit of it is? Hey, if you're going to jail, you Don't spoil the joke, asshole. If I'd have went to jail, I'd be getting out today. today. I've been around these old white fuckers all my life. They got their fat hands in Arab oil. The motherfuckers drink it like it's beer. That's why we're here to protect their property. Who do you think gave Saddam all his fucking weapons? We did. This is censorship. This is what? Censorship. You telling us what we can and can't say to the press. That's on America. Yeah, what about freedom of speech, the Constitution? No, you signed the contract. You don't have any rights. You poor bastard. I bet your recruiter promised you a whole wide world of pussy, huh? You fucking ate. Cop sucking you the price of every whore from Langapole to Stockholm. And here we are, headed to the desert, no pussy in a thousand miles. Fucked by the green weenie again. You got any complaints? You complain to Saddam Hussein and you see if he gives a fuck. Well, that's exactly what Saddam Hussein does. You're treating us the same way. You are a Marine. There's no such thing as speech that is free. You must pay for everything that you say.